Hey, it's Deb, my main gardens. We're gonna have a little plant talk today. Um, I'm very excited to introduce you to the newest member of my family, this Thai constellation Montera. And I think I said that right, but I'm not 100% certain. Um, all I know is that I paid more for this plant than I've paid for any house plant in my entire life. And I have zero regret about that. <laughs> that expenditure. Um, I've been doing my research on these constellation plants and the more I read, the more excited I am to own one now. Uh, why are they so expensive? They're um, rare and uh, hard to find and they have these beautiful variegated leaves that look like constellations. See that? Um, it's a uh, variety of philodendron and evidently very very small percent philodendron did I say that philodendron evidently a very very small percent of that variety um, have these unique have this unique foliage so I am wicked excited um, to own this plant and now I just want to take really good care of it <laughs> And so I've been doing my research. Um, what I've read so far is that they don't like to be in direct sunlight, uh, but they like light. So this room right here is nice. The light is filtered, comes through the windows. By the way, you can see it. There's still snow here in March, in May. So um, this purchase was good for my winter weary soul. And I know something I will join for, enjoy for years to come. So anyway, where was I? Right. Um, good light, not too direct, uh, keep them moist, but not overwatered. And because they are a tropical, they do like humidity. So, um, you know, you could spray it. What I might do is actually, I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm going to find the right spot. Um, bathroom might be good because of the humidity or maybe move it in there after a shower. We'll see. But anyway, I just wanted to introduce you. And if you have one of these, please um, give this girl, this new parent, some advice. What has worked for you? Where do you keep your Thai constellation in the house? How do you take care of it? Uh, and how is it growing? These are very slow growers. Again, according to my research, correct me if I'm wrong. Um, but boy, if you, if you look them up and you see the ones that are full grown, they are gorgeous. They're phenomenal plants. Um, yeah. So we're just getting started with this baby, but look, there's some new growth coming there. And I think we're going to have a beautiful relationship. So anyway, tell me about your Thai constellation Montero. Tell me if I pronounced, pronounced that right. Correct me if I said anything wrong, um, and share with me your lessons learned. Okay. I know so exciting. All right. I'll talk to you later. Thanks for hanging out with me and my new baby. Bye.